Cry havoc and let slip the dogs of war. William Shakespeare may have coined some of the best terms for war in the history of mankind, but history was full of great warriors, both before and after Shakespeare wrote quotable war cries. These five people may not be Hamlet, but they're still some of the greatest warriors of all time. I'm James from DinoCreek.com and this is 5 Greatest Warriors Ever. Number 5 William Wallace Long before Mel Gibson made him famous in the movie Braveheart, William Wallace was one of history's greatest warriors. This Scottish warrior was able to evade capture for years while defeating the British in several key battles. In particular, Wallace was able to fight back the Brits while horribly outnumbered, showing his intelligence at strategy as well as his fearless resolve. King Edward I of England eventually caught Wallace, giving him a death that showed just how much Wallace had angered the English. He was hanged, drawn, and quartered in front of an angry crowd. They may have taken his life, but they never took his freedom. Number 4 Joan of Arc Joan of Arc is perhaps the greatest female warrior that history has ever seen. In the 1400s, during the Hundred Years' War, Joan boldly convinced King Charles VII of France to put her at the head of his failing army. Joan courageously carried the battle flag, giving morale to the heavily demoralized troops and helping them turn the tide in several battles. Joan even took an arrow to the shoulder but still kept the flag raised high. Eventually, she was caught by the British, tried, and at the young age of 19, burned at the stake. Nevertheless, her heroism has been hailed by historians, especially French ones, and her religious fervor got her canonized as a saint. Number 3 Attila the Hun Attila the Hun was one of the most feared warriors of his time, and indeed of all history. In the middle part of the 3rd century, Attila wreaked havoc on the strongest and most widespread kingdom of his day, the Roman Empire. Although Attila was never able to conquer Rome, he laid waste to the Roman countryside time and time again. He was so feared that the Romans chose to leave him alone, instead of attacking him on his home turf. Unfortunately for his burgeoning empire, as soon as he died, the entire thing crumbled. Number 2 San Tzu San Tzu was one of the greatest warriors in all of Chinese and world history. His writings on military strategy are still studied to this day in the well-known book The Art of War. San Tzu helped China expand its empire during the spring and autumn period of China around 2,500 years ago. He is most notable not for how many people he was able to kill, but on his strategies that involved winning while minimizing conflict. One of his most often repeated quotes is this, The supreme art of war is to subdue the enemy without fighting it. <laughs> we give up, Sun Tzu. You win. Number 1 Alexander the Great Warriors hardly get more impressive than Alexander the Great. Alexander was so good at war that by the time he died at age 33, he had already conquered Persia, Egypt, Syria, and Mesopotamia. Alexander was also fond of naming cities after himself, the most famous of which is Alexandria in Egypt. Alexander the Great may have done all of his conquering during the 3rd century BC, but his influence not only helped reshape the map in the Middle East, it also spread Greek culture throughout the region. You can thank Alexander the next time you enjoy a delicious gyro. 
be sure to subscribe to our channel by clicking the red subscribe button. Dino Creek delivers amazing videos covering every possible topic on the planet. Every Monday, Wednesday and Friday, we'll release quality videos. Subscribe now and you'll automatically be notified when we do. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.